Hey guys, Bob McBride, Black Powder TV. So I thought I'd come out and do a quick video for you guys. I had a few comments and questions about where we're actually at, where the Black Powder TV compound is actually at. I mentioned in the 1842 Harper's Ferry video that we're in the hills of Middle Tennessee, six miles, four miles, three miles, one mile from my nearest neighbors and all of that stuff. So um, I thought, well, it's a perfect day to get out the drone and tell you about it. So. The Mavic 2 Pro uh, drone is a photography drone. It's a long range drone. It'll travel about, um, I don't know, five miles or so, five and a half miles at 400 feet maximum height and do shoot uh, um, as a 20 megapixel camera and uh, for, it can shoot 4K video as well. So I get out and take pictures of, um, you know, whatever interests me, old barns and all of that. So we'll go ahead and take off and um, and that's proximity alarm. It's reading the, uh, the truck and it's reading me. Um, but let's get up and take a look, see what we can see uh, from 400 feet. And so 40 feet coming up, that's the garden pasture you see beyond. And passing the tops of those trees at 110 feet. old barn we're at 230 feet we'll pan over you can see the range um, you'll remember i had a uh, umbrella over me um, doing the 1842 video on the range you can see that umbrella um, center screen there and the back of the hill that runs up behind uh, the shot that we did in that video so let's go ahead and head back on up um, 250 300 350. When this bumps again 400, it'll maximum tell us flight altitude maximum reach. flight altitude reach. So we're at 400 feet. Um, there's the range. There's a new barn. You can see the hogs back behind the barn. And um, we'll go ahead and pan up to the horizon a little too far. That's the top of the hill uh, behind the range. You can see the tree, the, uh, the fence line to the left that you saw behind the um, uh, behind the range in that video. Um, that's what's on the left. So you see what's on top of the hill, the back pasture. You got the left pasture, got the back pasture. And panning around. And see the other pasture. You can see the cattle in there. 17 head, 20, 22 head over there. Um, sh there's the, uh, the highest hill in our area. Pretty cool. Um, there is the neighbors. That's a little community, maybe uh, 20 families right there. And you can see off in the horizon, there's nothing else. So it's a long way. We're 35 miles or so from an interstate. Um, so there's our little community. That's all, you know, three miles away. Um, here's my neighbor here, 94 years old, still driving fence posts and running the tractor. Unbelievable. And the road out front, a couple more neighbors there. <coughs> and then back to that first pasture you saw with the old barn. So looking straight down, um, that's what you saw as we lifted off. Um, that um, is the, uh, on the left, you can see the, uh, the grape arbor uh, along that road, along the fence line is the, uh, the orchard uh, and mainly the garden, the bees, uh, the chickens, that kind of stuff. So stuff that's up close. Uh, which is nice to have close. So real quick, another pan. <clears throat> There's a water tower. We're on a well. The water tower doesn't serve us, serves that little community. We're off to the side a little bit. Back of the farm, side pasture, back to the community and coming straight down. That's our access road to the back and a straight down view of what's going on, <coughs> excuse me, of what's going on below. So you see me, see the pad, see the purple truck, see old blue, that's the old 94 F-150 um, that's uh, just here. So pretty cool. Anyway, that's what's going on out here. Uh, beautiful day, beautiful day to be in Tennessee, beautiful day to be alive. Um, if you guys are, <coughs> sorry, man, 
stay up, stand away from the screen. It's actually allergies. <coughs> Everything's coming in bloom. So if you guys are anywhere around, uh, you know, coronavirus, stay safe, stay out of the way, um, try to stay at home, keep your distance, do all those things. Uh, and we'll get through this just fine. So where are we at? We're 50 feet, so you can see it coming in and it's doing that all by itself. So pretty awesome. <clears throat> and that's not a dry cough either. So not coronavirus. So there it is, comes in, lands by itself. Pretty darn cool. Um, so glad you got to see uh, uh, our farm, got to see uh, Black Powder TV compound, right? Shut down, fenced in, gate out front. Um, we're clear of con uh, coronavirus in this little county on the farm. So actually there's none in our county or anything. But anyway, uh, thanks for sticking around. Um, hope you found this interesting. Um, you know, the scenery is beautiful. I, I may do another one of these in the fall because the foliage out there on those hills is unbelievable around here in the fall. We're, we're about a thousand feet up so um, uh, from sea level. So it's nice and colorful in the fall and stays cool. Um, you can drive 10 miles away, get off this uh, part of the plateau and, um, and it's four or five degrees warmer, you know. So that's bad in the winter maybe, but it's nice in the summer. So. Anyway, thanks for sticking around. Hope you got something out of it. Hope you liked it. Uh, now you know what's going on when we're back in the back in the deer stands when we're at the range. You know, maybe I'll take the four wheeler, drive past the hogs so you can see those. Um, one of the next shooting videos. So have a good one, guys. Take it easy. Mark, black powder, um, black powder maniac shooter. What's up, buddy? Bye.